Today we decided to um, do some lye. I'm in the process of learning how to make homemade soap. And we have a wood stove, if you can see it over there. So we're going to do it the old-fashioned way with wood ash. And what we did is we took the ash from the wood stove and we put it over here in a bucket. And then what was the next step after we so got the ash? Whatever container you're using, you filled up basically three quarters wood ash. And then you fill the rest up with water. Um, like in this particular container, I just put it up to there and I just filled it up to water, put up to here. Put it on the stove, bring it to a boil, um, stirring it up and everything. And I, I took a uh, scoop and I scooped all the chunks of charcoal off. Um, boil it until it comes to a boil for about five minutes and let it sit and cool off. And you can see it turns like a um, uh, apple like cider. Apple, yeah. apple cider, yeah. And then the way that you test it to see if it's strong enough, you take and put an egg or a potato in. We have a potato that we put in here. And the amount, it should float. And the amount that's sticking up should be equivalent to roughly um, a quarter. And we can see that it's sticking out roughly And you can use an egg quarter. too. So an egg or a potato floats quarter size. You're not supposed to really touch stuff with your hands, they say, but... Yes. There's no safety in this household, so, but they do recommend wearing rubber gloves and goggles because this is lye. And since we made the lye, we're going to transfer it with a plastic um, measuring cup into our mason jars. And then the next video we'll do is I'm going to be using this lye for some homemade soap. We're going to use some, uh, you can use animal fats, deer tallow is supposed to work great, bear fat, um, hog fat, uh, any type of fat, or you can use any type of like a... Uh, Coconut oil, lard, shortening, lard, olive shortenings, oil. Olive oil. So we'll, um, I'm going to decide on what type of oil that I'm going to use. I, I was going to use oat coconut oil but I think it's a little expensive so we'll see what we've got laying around and we will make um, another video on how to do the homemade soap but that's homemade lye pretty easy just get the ash water boil it down and voila